Hello everybody and welcome back to Dinosaur Adventures. This week's adventure is a scavenger hunt based on some of the fun facts that we learned about the Brontosaurus in our last installment. A fun variation to this activity is instead of looking for the items around your house, you can also look for some of these items on the internet. However, before you start doing that, make sure you have your parents' permission and also some supervision as well before you start looking around on the internet for some of these fun items. All right, are you ready? Let's get started. Well, the Brontosaurus was a plant eater, so I thought it'd be fun for us to look for a plant. Now, since it's a rainy day, I'm actually gonna look for a plant inside the house because I don't wanna go inside and get wet. So let's come over here, see if we can find some plants. Oh. There's a plant, and there's a plant. They look like a really delicious, tasty treat for the brontosaurus. So another fun fact about the brontosaurus is that they move very, very slowly. So I thought it would be fun to see how slow you can move. Let's give it a try. I'm gonna use my dinosaur binoculars for this one. Bring it very slowly. seeing the brontosaurus moving very slowly moving slowly so the brontosaurus was featured on a US postal stamp so I thought it would be fun for us to look for a stamp so what would be some things that use a stamp, a postage stamp? Let's go look around. I think I have an idea as to where I can find one. I'm gonna come down into my home office area. And I look down here. Oh, look at that. I have a whole roll of postage stamps. Look at that. And they're from Canada. So stamps. So we just looked for some stamps. So the next fun fact is that the Brontosaurus lived mainly in North America. So I thought it'd be an interesting idea for us to look for a map of North America on the internet. So we're gonna come over to my computer. I've already got the Google page open. And we're just going to type in North America. Uh, mare, eh, ka, and oh look, the first thing that came up is North America map, so I'm going to click on that. Oh, look at all these beautiful images. I'm just going to click on one of these images here and see a lot of the United States maps. Ooh, here's a nice big colorful map of North America. Look at that. So this is where the Brontosaurus mainly lived, lived in North America. Oh, I think I hear something moving around upstairs. Hmm, I wonder what it could be. Let's go investigate. Okay, so I just came upstairs because I heard some moving around. And as I'm looking around, I see, oh, look at that. We've got some dinosaur tracks. Just, I hope those are dinosaur tracks. Let's see where they lead to. Oh, I see a little tail poking out. See a little tail poking out. Let's see if I move some of the stuff around. Oh my goodness, let's see if I can coax out Mr. Oh, there he is. Mr. Brontosaurus. Look at you with your long neck and your long tail. Hello, Mr. Brontosaurus. I'm glad we were able to find you. Hey everybody and welcome back. How did you do on your scavenger hunt? Were you able to find all of the fun items on the list? Join us next time where we will be learning some fun facts about the Pterosaurus, or as it's commonly called, Pterodactyl. So join us next week, we'll learn some fun facts about the Pterosaurus. Have a great week, we'll see you next time.